What's up guys, Trey here from Topic Tech and I have a really cool video to show you guys. This is a way for you to stream to multiple platforms directly from your browser. Let's get started. Before we get started, I do want to thank our sponsor for this video, Restream.io. Restream is a multi-streaming website that allows you to reach a wider audience by streaming to multiple platforms at the same time. It's a great way to broaden your horizon, meet new people, and maybe even put yourself in front of a face that maybe you've never found you if you weren't on that particular platform. Without adding strain to your computer, Restream allows you to stream to multiple platforms at one time, such as Twitch, Facebook, YouTube, Mixer, and even other websites through RTMP. It allows you to easily combine those and stream out the same quality content at the same time without adding stress to your computer. If you'd like to give it a try for yourself, there's a link in the description down below. That is a free version of this whole software where you don't have to pay for anything um, or if you wanted to restream to multiple locations. But if there are more things that you want to unlock with the professional or the business plan, using that link down below gives you a $10 credit and it does directly support me as well too. So thank you so much for checking it out. Let's get started. So this video specifically highlights using your web browser. So just going to the website to live stream. You don't have to download OBS. You don't have to set up different scenes. If you're wanting to just broadcast, get your video out there. This is great for like product reviews or if you're doing seminars, and especially in this day and age where social distancing is important. We're not able to be in the office or meet, meet in a classroom. It'll allow you to stream to not only just one streaming platform, but multiple streaming platforms as well, too. Uh, when you go to Restream.io, it's the very first tab or the second tab is called Live Studio. This section out here allows you to live stream directly from your website. You don't have to install any kind of software. It finds your web camera. It finds your microphone. And then all you have to input is where you want to start streaming um, under destinations. This is where you'll add it. Right now, I just have uh, my Twitch account, my Mixer account, my YouTube account, and then my Amazon Live account all linked into here. So I simply just have to go to my studio. It accesses my camera, it accesses my microphone, and we're ready to simply go live. Now, if you're wanting to add more to this scene, if there's something else that you're wanting to uh, give to make it even more professional, there's a captions section here. You can add things such as, and it's locked in place, so you don't have to really move it around or accidentally mess things up, but you can have it where it shows, follow me on Twitter, at Topic Tech. Um, you can even have some pre-planned, like scripted things for your broadcast. So if you're just doing like a, a TED talk or talk show or just talking to your audience um, directly, you can have things show up on screen like a pineapple and pizza. So you can you can have whatever topic you're talking about already just pre-planned here. And it's very easy to add. Um, all you have to do is type it in here. And then the secondary text will show as this does where under here it shows my at set my ad tag for Twitter in red. So easy to add, easy to do. And then you just add caption and there it is. And then it just shows you right there. Super easy to add and, and update those things as you are live. Uh, not really a whole lot to mess with or, or, or fool with with software. Um, it doesn't move on the actual screen, so it stays in that particular location. You can hide it as well, too, if you don't want to see it. And then if you're also wanting to add different graphics, it's very simple. You can upload your own graphics, such as I did here. And it puts your logo whoosh, right in the corner right up there, making it very simple. You can have, add overlays such as this. If you want your own custom made overlay, you can upload your own overlays as well, too. But here's also where you would turn on and off your destinations. So if you're wanting to stream to Twitch, Mixer, YouTube, and then my example, uh, Amazon Live. I normally go live on, on Mixer and then I'll do a segment where I stream to Amazon Live simultaneously. And I would just click that on and then both, both feeds will be sent out that you see on this screen here. Both feeds will be sent out to both, both locations. I can change the title, also add a description, but then all I have to do is hit go live. And while you're live, you would come here and both of the chats, now the Restream chat doesn't support all channels. Uh, for example, the Amazon Live does not have a chat that links with it because it's not, a, it's a custom RTMP. However, YouTube and Twitch will link their chats into this one chat room. 
and you'll be able to see your video in the same feed that they'll see as well too through your webcam through the website so again no software that you need to install it's all in one place it's very easy to kind of keep up with and makes it very easy to start streaming you don't have to you know, learn how to use a, a new software it's basically just all built into the website now that another option is you can also share your desktop as well too if you're wanting to share what you're what you're looking at on your screen uh, you simply come here and you can click here it gives you the option to have two screens it gives you the option of what screen you're wanting to share and then you can click and share and now you'll you'll see the reverb but you'll also get to um, see the desktop and you can play a game called like call of duty the only thing you can't do at the same time is share your webcam as well as the desktop at the same time it's the only thing that i could say um, that isn't a feature that i see as of yet maybe it's something they add in the future but this will allow you to share gameplay or, or maybe there's something in an excel file uh, for a meeting that you're wanting to share um, you can do that simply by sharing it there as well too you can also and a really cool thing is you can also invite guests so if there's somebody that you want to do an interview with this makes it very easy to do interviews it invites them to your channel um, it gives them a direct link that they can go to and it'll pull their video feed and combine it with yours as well too so also nothing something that's in beta but it's also something that is uh, pretty unique with this particular browser um, streaming site so hopefully it was helpful hopefully this is something that was interesting for you guys to give it a try if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment box down below. I am also live every day on mixer.com forward slash topic tech. Uh, you can also hit me up on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, everywhere is at topic tech. Hopefully this video was great and easy for you guys to understand. But if you do have any questions, please let me know. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for being here. Guys, I appreciate it. We'll see you in the next one. Deuces.